Hey guys, what time six here watching Dark. This is season one, episode nine called Everything Is Now. If you enjoy our videos, make sure to like, comment down below, and subscribe. Hit the bell icon so you're notified as soon as we upload our videos. Also, you can check out our Patreon page, get the next four episodes. That means season two is on Patreon right now, along with full uncut reactions or even episode requests. Check that out. And we want to do a quick recap. We all do that, right? The dark. Um, well, already beat the crap out of well, oh, yeah. yeah, so kid. last episode, they we got 1953, right? Yeah. Yeah. We got all these characters. Uh, we got the... Uh, and we got a lot of wormhole information, right? Mm-hmm. Uh, with the... So someone in the comments uh, said that the hood guy is called the stranger. Yeah, I read that. The yeah. stranger. Oh, well, like, we just call him the hood guy. So yeah, yeah. Easier to call him the stranger. But the main thing was Ulrich beating up Elg. Elg, yeah. As a kid. With a rock. Now and we then, know why his ears are fucked up. Yeah, yeah we know what the accident was there. at the cabin. Yeah. Right? And anything else? So here, Rachel Domenchi was an Erkunft. So an Entstehung. From God geschaffen? Or a product of the evolution? They look so similar, it's like. <laughs> I don't know how they do that. I think this is probably my favorite intro of all time. Of any show. More than Westworld? I think Westworld is the best intro. No, I saw. I have, I have yet to see Westworld. You haven't seen Westworld? Yeah, no. What? The is first it good? season. No, nah, your Westworld like that intro just makes you like. The first season is good. Yeah. I only watched the first. first I mean, I watched half of the second season. I didn't like it. Yeah, first right. season was really. Yeah, you should watch the first season. Three different buttons on it. Whoa! Oh, whoa, 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 whoa! to go man <laughs> fucking Ulrich <laughs> good he knows bro <laughs> he knows he's gotta go to go back in the cave yeah so take a shortcut yeah he was so close to the cave He really thinks he changed the timeline. Hey, he's dead. He will never kill you again. You're the Lord. Turn around. Turn around. Ulrich, come on. I don't know who that is. 
shot? That's hilarious. Damn. She did come between the fish. Yeah. Dude. That's why she went after Regina? Hannah did this. We knew that one. Oh, we did? Yeah. Oh, yeah, we did. We just didn't see it. Oh, because he arrested Ulrich before. This is why he. Dude. A dog? It's a dog. The white dog, right? Gretchen! Yeah, Gretchen's back. Dude, I told you. Shot, I think. Is this supposed to be the the hood guy? Maybe it's not Jonas. Oh, he does look like him. No. I don't know who this stranger is yet. Name. Name. Alexander. I have no idea who have Alexander. Have you heard that before? Oh my fucking god. What? No, I don't even remember everyone's fucking name. No idea who Alexander is. I haven't heard that. Help. Mm hmm. Older help. What? Creeping on younger. <laughs> this is because they had the meeting, right? He didn't show up. Alexander. Wait. Fuck. Sixty. Wait, no way. Dude, dude, dude. My brain's going all over the place. Bring the resume, dog. Tut mir leid. Im Moment brauchen wir keine neuen Leute. Aber vielleicht bald. Wie kann ich Sie erreichen? Na, ich komme einfach morgen wieder vorbei. Is Alexander the future husband? Probably. Oh, Regina? Es gibt keinen Gott. Gott hat dieses Loch noch nicht erschaffen. Gott hat keinen Plan. Es gibt überhaupt gar keinen Plan. Da draußen ist nur Chaos. Anfang und das Ende. Scheiße. Lange 
Are you going to be fighting everyone? Jeez. You lying piece of shit. He ended it. I never wanted any of it. She is a lying manipulative piece of crap. She's the worst, man. She sucks. Oh Even God. now. She's, she's lying, bro. Oh you gotta God. read the tides. She's such a bitch, bro. She's like a pathological liar. Dude, it's like the second time she's like screwed her over. She's playing her. Can I help you? You have to wait. I'm Claudia, your grandmother. Yeah, see? Yeah, see, that's Alexander. What? This crazy bitch. She sucks. She sucks. She's the she real. Vil she's the real villain of the show. More than Noah. I don't know that. I think Noah's the villain right now. No, no, no. definitely. Jo Jonas sucks or Jonas? Jonas is a good guy, and his mom's a piece of shit. Dude, the mom sucks, bro. Dude, you gotta say something. Yeah, his mouth just droops open. Uh, Don't just stand. Say something, man. It was wrong. No, because you're his aunt. Okay, that's freaking. Don't say that. Yeah. Jeez, he's harsh. Yeah. He could have rolled with the Bartosz. Oh my. Dude. <laughs> She's I mean, desperate, bro. He's letting it happen too, okay? He's not stopping it. Look at this. He knows who she is, but he's not stopping it. <laughs> Jonas, no! <laughs> oh. Is this guy inside, man? Yes, yes. Oh, shit. Mr. Eye Patch. How long has he had this eye patch for, I wonder? Now what? You got all oh, three. Oh, the big one's turning. Oh, so everything now. That's what that means. All the years came up, and now it's now. Oh, he's fucking with him. Shit, Noah. Yo, he actually looks, it exactly, actually looks like a Yeah, male. he looks exactly like the father. <laughs> what the fuck? I think it's his Elg. It's gonna laugh. Elg? Or is it the eye patch guy? Who is it? Uh, oh, it could be Mr. Eye Patch. Because he was talking about a truck, right? Yeah. Yeah, and the barrels. So, so it has oh, to be eye patch guy then, right? Because we know this is 20. Oh, whoa, oh, whoa, wait, whoa, no. whoa, whoa. Okay, never mind. Oh, he's reverse engineering the phone. Yeah. This is a sign. A wormhole. They should have Gretchen like right here, the dog. How do they not put Gretchen in this? Yeah, Gretchen's a key character. The whole show revolves around Gretchen. Yeah, we could go down the because I like the setup of this episode. Yeah, yeah. It went from the oldest timeline to the newest, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Except for that cliffhanger where Claudio shows up. But, so, you want to talk about that machine first, the way it was working? So, yeah, that, that's how I was curious, because oh, I wonder what it represents. At first, it, I thought it was going to be like but a Ben... I think ben, I know what it represents. I thought it was going to be like a Ben 10 thing, where like you, you slap it down and like, I don't know, you go in time or something. 
what I'm curious about is how is that machine connected to the tunnels? There's three buttons. Because we assume that when you go through the tunnel, that's the wormhole. But how does that machine play a factor in it, right? Maybe it's connected somehow, but... But let's go up, let's go through the timelines now. And the machine is made in the future. No, it's made well, in 53. It's made in the past, but it's designed in the future? Because blueprints, yeah. right? Did they have those kind of blueprints in no, That's 53? a mind fuck. I guess, I guess so. He had the technology to build it in 53, so... Yeah, no, she went to him in 53, so that's when... Or at least that's when he gets started on making it. Yeah. We don't know how long it takes him, right? But by 86, it's done. We know that because uh, the stranger and the timekeeper, they're chatting in 86. I'm really curious to know how the machine works. <clears throat> but, um, Excuse me. One thing is, wait, I want to check the thing here. Agnes Nielsen said the husband was a pastor. Yes. What do we make of that? Because I think within this community, a lot of people are in contact with Noah. So they know who Noah is, the pastor. So wouldn't it be someone else? Because it, feel, it feels like they ran away from somewhere else. Right? What do you mean? Oh. The Nielsens. Hmm. You know the story behind the Nielsens, right? Like the Trump was saying it to Claudia, that they ran away. Uh, not right away, but uh, the mom wanted to change, so they left, right? Yeah. So, do we know where they left from? Mm, or like, are they, they just on the other side of town? Or yeah, are they, like, exactly, maybe. from a different town? Because if they're from the same or town... Or it's a lie. Or all of it's a lie. But, they but they're new to the city, to the town anyway, so... It's yeah, they are new, yeah, the yeah, truth. because of the... Yeah. I don't know, I just thought that was strange, though. She said the husband was a pastor. Maybe because that's when Noah's terror begins in the... Maybe Noah has a, other uh, minions that work for him. We know that in 86, Helg is work, working for him. And Helg goes through time. Mm -hmm. So maybe that means something. But... <laughs> my note here, Noah is sus. I had to write that. But the important thing in 53 is Egon catches Ulrich. Yeah. Ulrich is currently being held and captive be in 53. Because he arrested the older Ulrich, his whole life, Egon has been sus of the younger Ulrich, right? Yeah. Without even knowing that it's the same person. Mm -hmm. Because he just he just knows that face. Like, that's a crazy, like, realization, yo. Yeah. Because before, like, yo, why the fuck does this guy hate uh, Ulrich? But now it makes sense. Where is he? Egon. Tiedemann. 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 Titty man. <laughs> Fuck, far is out here for that. We got a lot of Tiedemanns this episode. Yeah, Alexander is also sketch. Uh, and that was it for 53, right? Yeah, so then in 86, that's where Alexander is, right? And he, when we first get introduced to him, he's running away with a wound. Mm -hmm. He has a gun on him. And two passports. And no one seems to be following him. Did we see anyone chasing him? No. So what the fuck was he running from? Oh, that's a good or question. did he come out of the cave? Maybe. Gr Gretchen was chasing him. <laughs> Probably. Because Gretchen's Gretchen ties this all together. I'm calling it. But, uh, what else? Yeah, we saw that. So... R Regina knows that there's some stuff going on in the cave, and she had uh, Alexander. No, 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 sorry. Claudia had Alexander, uh, I guess, weld that whatever door that was closed. But before that, uh, we, we saw how Regina and Alexander meet, right? So he protected her from. Katerina? Katerina, yeah. And we know in 2019 they're married. Yeah. And they have this kid, Bartos. Uh, Bartos, Bartos. how you say it? Which is interesting. Oh, uh, what else? The older Helg was creeping on the younger one. Yeah, that's What weird. do we make of that? I mean, not, not much, honestly. Like, where, where did he go? Wait, wait, we he saw was him just behind a tree. No, he was we behind a tree and then he went walking somewhere. We didn't get a resolution for where he went. Yeah. 
And he was also hiding from uh, Egon, who showed up, right? So, that's something. So, Alexander gets a job at the plant. Mm. We also find that Noah and Helg are in the wallpaper room. Mm-hmm. They're seemingly putting it together, assembling it. Yeah, so... So it's built in... That ages. is the bunker, right? Allegedly. That's something we've been predicting for a few episodes. Yes, they are. it is the bunker, but where are they building it is the question. What do you mean, in the bunker? Did we see them go inside there? No, that's the theory. Like That's what we were predicting. That's what I'm asking. Is it is it the bunker? Yes, it has to be. Yeah. Of, because of the... Uh, the paper and Noah called it called the chair Noah's Ark so I think there's some hidden meanings here with religion which we're probably not picking up on because we're idiots but some of you know okay and then we go to 2019 Wait, is that everything in 1986 uh cloudy uh yeah, Claudia finds Gretchen also. Uh, yes. I forget that. That's, yeah, that's the biggest is. moment. So it's Gretchen just, is chilling in... So Claudia knows something's, not, something's off. Yeah, before she even confronted... Uh, who's the guy? Uh, Bird Doppler. This is a previous plant owner, right? So... That dog, yo. How did it get through the tunnels? Oh, because Helg threw a stick in it, I guess, and just got lost. Well, a dog can't open a gate. I guess. That means Helg is probably fucking around. Or. Going back and forth. Or, there's another way. Maybe the, the gate was made later or something. Maybe it should just be a hole. No, the gate is there, because all it comes in through the gate. Yeah, you're right. So, the, the gate is there. The gate is there, for sure. Yeah. Everything is now, so. Hey, everything yeah. is now, yeah. So, now we can go to 2019. Hannah has the passport that Alexander buried in 86. And she uses that... It's blackmail. To blackmail him. While also destroying Katharina's feelings, right? She liked... Yo. Yep. Hannah, Hannah became the main villain last episode. This episode. This episode. <laughs> Dude. I don't know what to do. Like, Hannah is just... No words. Yeah, she really sucks. She manip- and she's manipulating everyone around her, and she has been her whole life. Why does she want to destroy Ulrich? That's a question. Yeah, what is she? I don't know. So my assumption was, uh, she's gonna plant the seeds in Katharina, that Ulrich never loved her. Yeah. And then Katharina would slowly drift apart. Yeah, she could take Ulrich. And then Ulrich when from... Ulrich is alone, yeah. then she comes in, right? Yeah, and takes him. it takes him for herself. But now she wants she wants to destroy both of them. Like literally get him killed. Like, Wait, did she say? No, she said destroy. She didn't say kill. Isn't that the same thing? No. Destroy means like destroy... Like financially ruin him? It could, it could mean anything. Destroy is vague, right? It could be like destroying reputation, destroying financials, destroying family, right? It doesn't necessarily mean to kill someone. It can mean like ruin their life, you know? In whatever way. Okay. Okay, so in this context, it's like a social thing. Like blackmailing it. Like, like he's gonna like release some information that he's like a pedophile or something. Like... Like what socially some, destroy him. They find some information that he beat a kid in 53. Yeah, something like that. <laughs> but apparently um, he, he was calling him about some b- barrels. He was going to like move the barrels or something. No, that's the other guy. That's the Mr. Eyepatch. Well, we'll get to that no, after. But he, we'll get to that after. That that was a phone call, right? That he yeah, but he wasn't him. talking to, to Ulrich. He was talking to the Eyepatch guy. I know, but it, this is... I'm assuming this is about... Yeah, but we'll, we'll get to that after. Separate, okay, we yeah, just yeah, found out yeah, some okay, shit about okay, the Eyepatch guy, right? Before that, I want to talk, because I want to stay with the, with Hannah's family. I want to talk about Jonas and Martha, right? Because that was a weird, a weird scene where I get that Jonas is like an awkward guy. But yo, he has to start talking and just explain it to her, right? Because nah, bro. He could have, if he explained it, he could have stopped that kiss. Explain you what? know, he could have just not kissed her too, you know. He, yeah, he could have just he could have done <laughs> like, that. He could have pulled back. <laughs> and he didn't do that either. dog, man. Got no but yo, it's, okay, this is what I would do. Like, instead of being like, he, he said some hard shit, right? Like, he's like, oh, we're not a good fit. Bro, he's like, oh, come with me. We go to the cave. You take her to one of the things. 
Do you though? Why not? Do you tell her the truth? Do Why you not? show her the truth? Why not? Well, wait, what's the repercussions? Like if you don't, I don't exactly. I I wouldn't know. What if it screws up everything or something? I'd be too afraid of ruining the timeline. What if she goes and screams bloody murder to the town and <laughs> everyone starts rushing into this cave? Bro, it's, a, it's a disaster. My line of thinking is that everything is now, so whatever you do is supposed to happen. That's my thinking, right? So even if she destroys the town, that's supposed to happen. So because he didn't do it, then that was what was supposed to happen. No, I'm just saying what I would do in that situation. Yeah. I would take her to the thing, one of the years, right? But, but does he know that, though? What? Does Jonas know everything is now, though? Bro, I'm saying what I would do, man. <laughs> yeah, but if you were in that situation, Wait, didn't what, um, know? the stranger explain it to him? If anything, didn't the stranger stop him from interacting with uh, his with me? Oh, yeah, he doesn't know everything is now. So he, he just would, knows. Yeah. I think I think to... he would be more afraid. Okay, yeah. fine. So that's probably why he didn't, right? Yeah. He probably didn't because he's afraid uh, that by telling her. I don't like, think that's the reason. Out. I think he's just an awkward guy. That's why he didn't, right? Yeah. Why? Why did he just say it was he's not thinking Bartha. that deeply, right? I would have said it's, he's it's right now, bro. Right now, this is just some new shit that happened to him. He yeah, doesn't know what to make of it, right? Yeah. He's, so he's, he's like he's in frazzled. His, yeah. So, I mean, she wants him clearly, and. He wants her to, but after what he knows, he's hesitant, right? Yeah. So, sucks for Bartos, that guy. And, speaking of Bartos, he met up with Noah again. He said, your predictions came true, which I'm assuming is about Claudia coming back, right? Because that's the thing, because that's the most recent thing that happened to him, right? Whoa. What? What did you figure out? No, no, no nothing. It's just... Like, putting... Like, we already know about Jonas' association, but, like, thinking... Yeah, for Jonas, this must be so whacked out. What? Knowing that, that uh, Mikkel's his dad and everything. Bro, I already moved on to the next person. No, but... I, no, I, I think Jonas, like, he's frazzled for sure. Like, 100%. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I said that, yeah. Like, yeah. No, I I think he responded, like, <laughs> kind of like normally. <laughs> There's two storylines behind what we're discussing. No, no, I'm just saying that I, I do think that considering it has happened, I think that his behavior is acceptable, reasonable. Okay, so back to Bartos. That's what I was talking about. Mm -hmm. He went to Noah, said your prediction, uh, my predictions came, or your predictions came true. And I'm assuming that's about Claudio coming back, right? Yeah, the grandma, that's what I'm thinking too. And he said he's willing to take the offer or deal, whatever the fuck Did he? Was. He said, no, he... No, Noah asked him, he's like, oh, are you willing to... No, he's, no, yeah, no, he said, have you been thinking about the offer? He said, yes, and I think that's where it ended, right? Thinking or considering, yeah, whatever. But point is, I don't think whatever we, the deal is, he's going he's to take it. But did, did he agree to it in the car? I think it's safe to assume he's going to take the deal. Right? What do you know. think the deal is? I don't know. Okay. <laughs> well, what do you think it is? Here, what's your theory? Why do you think... Yeah, what, what do you think the deal is then? I think the deal is Bartos is going to be the new hell. They're going to make another bunker, right? Oh. He wants to continue the Noah arc thing. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah that makes sense too. I wonder if there's other Francisco's spots. Francisco's banging Magnus, if that matters. I don't think it matters. Yeah, yeah we already knew that though. Uh, so Mr. Ipatch, we can talk about him now. He Who is not inside on here, guy. Right? So it, it was always... uh. Kind of comedic, right? He would always come in, like with uh, Charlotte and Ar uh, Ulrich. He's like, "Oh, I want to help," and they just they just brush him off, right? Now we find out that like why he was so eager. Wait a second, yeah, wait, because why he is he on man. here? He's under uh, Titty Man's employee, Alexander. And that's an interesting thing. Alexander took Regina's last name, right? Yeah. That's probably because he's not a fully formed. I mean, he doesn't have identity. Yeah, that's exactly what I. That's exactly why. So that's something to think about. And. So, just the last thing is, Regina is in the stranger's room in twenty nineteen, and she finds all that shit, right? So what do we think? I mean, we can't really say anything because she just finds it. But what do you think that's going to lead to? Like, who's she going to tell first? The police? Mm. Police or... Her husband. Yeah, that's what I was thinking, And then right? he's going to... And he's already sus. Yeah, he already knows. He's already sus. dealing with barrels with Mr. Eyepatch. Yeah. 
the, the stranger has brown hair and Jonas has wait what does Jonas have dirty blonde hair oh I thought it was a lighter blonde oh yeah oh yeah see same hair color so I think the stranger is Jonas I don't know cause before I thought Jonas was a lighter blonde bro the casting yeah, right, is right, so right. good in the yeah, show yeah the casting is really really good like I don't know how they, like are they using effects to make them look like each other or they just got good people I guess like it's just picking, the hired actor. I don't know man some good shit uh, so yeah, uh, Regina's probably going to tell Alexander and that's not going to go lead anywhere because he's probably in on it, right? And I guess that's it, right? Yeah. He, yes. He had like some weird, like, he put some metal tube down or something. I yeah, what was that? The, yeah, I wonder what's in the barrel. Is there something telling me it's not like nuclear waste? Something else. No, didn't she use the, the, the fuck's it called? The radioactive... Thing. Yeah, but remember the remember we're, we're, we're assuming there's a door or something in there, right? And the doors are radioactive, right? No, I thought uh, she when she pointed it at that like she was at the side, she pointed it at the barrel, and then it started clicking like super fast. Unless oh. there's something behind the barrel. Yeah, maybe the door is behind the barrel. Oh, I think the barrel is the barrel. Like, like why would you be hiding it, right? All right, guys, that was dark episode nine, of season one. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to like, comment down below, and subscribe. Remember on Patreon, Season 2 has already started. Get ahead with those reactions. Link is down below. Along with the full reactions. And we'll see you next week. Peace.